Just another fantastic day out here. What's going on guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408 here. We got some big stuff happening. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, hit notifications, do all the fun stuff. Follow Justin. He takes all the photos and does there's all no the- There's no merch plug here. There's no merch plug. No well, it's merch. on the back kind of. Sort of. There you go. We have a few limited edition t-shirts. So we're going to be doing an Instagram contest soon. and. This shirt will be a part of it. Rockstar. So it's LTD, Rockstar, Freedom 408, Canadian, work boots. Yeah. Anyways, so uh, I've been waiting for these rims and tires to come from STI. And there was some, I'm dealing with a whole bunch of people. So you got to go through the chain of command. And they weren't actually going to show up until another week or two. And then they're like, yeah, they're not coming. And then that was last night. And then this morning they showed up. So the rims are here. Apparently the tires were on the same truck, but I don't know if the guy forgot them or if they're on a different truck, but they're they're somewhere in transit and we're hoping they come today because I'm heading to Michigan tomorrow. We're going to try and bang off three videos today and then we're going to do all the Michigan videos. So lots of side-by-side -side stuff, but Justin, you want to hold that? I'll uh, do a quick unboxing. So these are fresh from STI, um, Moto Van distributes them. And uh, yeah, they're the bronze, bronze rims. That's all I know. <laughs> I like your little cigar box there, whatever that is. Yeah, it's for my, my, my Cohibas, my Cubans. So these are the rims. They are beadlocks, they're pretty stiff. Ooh. I think they're five plus two offset. So I think they're an inch, inch wider than normal. Nice. So yeah. Hopefully the tires show up today and we can slap these bad boys on. Here's a little sticker for you. Wash with soap and water only. Harsh chemicals made to scolor the finish of the wheel. 10 I like four. that. It's a nice, what is that? Copper gold is it called or something? This is bronze. Just bronze? Okay. I believe it's bronze, yeah. I don't know colors. I see blue, I say blue. <laughs> so these are all the bolts for the beadlocks, as you can see. And then, I don't know why they couldn't just throw this in the box. This was a separate package. Just all the nuts for them, so. There's three more like that. I don't know why one came in this box, but it's all the same, so fell anyways. Off. That one fell off the truck. Yeah, it must have fell off the truck. Um, also, Tyler Summers was here this morning. I, I regret not putting him on the story because everyone always asks where Tyler Summers has been, but uh, he sold me his GoPro Hero 6. He bought one, didn't use it, so he sold it to me, so instead of paying full price, I got a better price and the thing is you got the summer discount i got the summer discount <laughs> so um let's head down the track we're going to take two cars to scrapyard then we're going to light a van on fire that'll be a video then we're going to do a van jump video and then hopefully the tires show up and we can throw them on here and we'll do a quick maverick video after that and then michigan i'm leaving for michigan at 4 a.m tomorrow so cool, cool, cool no sleep for the youtuber so let's uh carry on we are ripping now. Woo! What's up? So yeah, we have got a lot of rain the last couple days, and I love it. We needed the rain for sure. So there's probably a big puddle at the bottom of the jump. I did, I did put that little drainage uh, ditch in there, but we might have to scoop a little more out. Anyways, we're gonna load up. Uh, we're gonna load something up. Probably the Buick. We need to get that Buick out of the way. We need to get rid of that Buick, the Cadillac, and the Sport Track. They're just an eyesore. Get rid of them. Keep going. Figured while we're down here, we might as well pull the cat off. Yeah. This thing works amazing for cutting pipe. Like literally 30 seconds, I cut that. So we'll pull that banger out of there, and then we'll uh, let's load up that Buick. Time to get rid of the web. I think that was the easiest one yet. Popped right out of there. That she sounds nice. She says she's all straight pipe. All right, let's get this. Uh, let's get this Buick loaded up. Carry on. Do it. Let her down nice and easy there, Tim. I didn't smash the window out. It's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a great day. Oh, I flowers. I saw a garter snake over here while we were under the car. I can't remember the last time I saw a garter snake. I know in the States you guys have all kinds of snakes, but here in Canada, we don't have a whole lot of snakes. But I see them, I'll point them out. One of these days we're going to get rid of this puddle. Let's see if I can use this and 
clear a trench out or something. Just push and scrap. Hey, found the shovel. Hang on to it there, Harry. See if we can pick this thing up from the back under it. It's always a struggle getting these loaded. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, that didn't quite work. I thought the door wasn't going to open. Uh, all right. Getting this water log here. Let's see if we can steer this thing. Tim? We might have a bit of an issue loading that. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's gonna go on. I'm there. not much of a mechanic, but I don't think that's supposed to be there. I think that's to supposed there. to be connected, no? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that thing's supposed to be there and that thing's supposed to be in there. Well, what we could do, I could either lift up the front you can back under, or we can turn it around and I'll push it on backwards. Yeah, I like the backwards idea. You wanna do it backwards? I like backwards. I won't be able to steer anything, so I'll just have to guide you. Just to let you know, Eminem came on as I was getting out. I was a little disappointed. Oh. Mom's spaghetti. Shoot. Arms are heavy. I don't know. So. I mean, I almost pulled Dukes of Hazard on the door, and then they like, no, <laughs> they no. Just opened up, right? <laughs> like, no, no. This wheel's fine. I feel like if we push it on, the frame's just going to catch on. Oh, the, yeah, 100%. And it's just going to destroy the trailer. Um, yeah, let's flip it around. Yeah, let's try it from the back. Where's the old Malibu? Look at this thing. Just got beat on. It wasn't even a good jump. It kind of just like rolled over. But uh, it was overheating. I don't know if you guys remember the jump video, but it was overheating. We just did the demo derby with it. So we didn't have high expectations. It was a pretty freaking comfortable car though. I'll give you that. That's for sure. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. I can't believe. Did this happen as I was pushing it? Doing? Oh, just doing seatbelt things? Yeah. yeah, that's crazy. Ripped her. Sheared her right off there, Frank. She gone. Anyways, we're gonna get rid of this thing. I think he's got a minivan for us. Kinda looks like rain. You don't make it rain. Apparently there was tornadoes yesterday or I don't know. I got that tornado alert on my phone. It scared the shit out of me. But uh yeah, I'm gonna see if we can grab the minivan. And then we'll head back to the house. Maybe we'll do a minivan fire video today. We haven't done a fire video in a while since the Lambo one. I can't believe that didn't. Only got like 5,000 views. Lamborghini through fire. You think that would have done the most one. expensive video you've ever done? Yeah, well, most expensive car. But oh well, can't win them all. Let's get rid of this thing. I don't know what Sam's doing back there. Playing with a dump truck bin. take half the trailer too. <laughs> the old spinner. Right there. Or do. Either way. 
see what else they got. She is trying to rain on us, but it hasn't really started yet. So we're gonna take this down. We're gonna do a little flamethrower um, minivan video. She works, she's getting a little stiff there. Yeah. Needs to be worked in. So the rims arrived, and unfortunately, I just got an email. There was an error at Pure Later. They put the tires on a different truck and they ended up in Toronto. So apparently they're not coming until Monday. But I have seen weirder things happen. Like these things weren't even supposed to ship till next week and they arrived today. So fingers crossed they come, but it uh, doesn't look like they're coming till next week. So unfortunately, well, we're still taking the Maverick up north. It's just not going to have the freshy tires. But uh, yeah, let's load this potato gun up, do a little fire and uh, carry on. <laughs> this van is hurting. She's struggling. I think the tranny is starting to go or it's basically gone. <laughs> she gonna make it? I feel like the first gear is pretty much gone. Yeah. Can you get going at all? For a second. <laughs> Maybe if I push you. It is raining good. Holy. Well, we got a bit of an issue. So the tranny is starting to go on this thing. She's leaking fluid quick underneath. So what we're gonna do, reverse works really good. So we're gonna reverse up the hill. And then when you put it in gear, as long as it starts rolling, it kind of clicks in. So we're still gonna do the fire video. We just need a bit of help from the hill. So I'm gonna set up right here. Justin's gonna reverse up the hill and slam and drive and fly by. And then if there's still any life left in it, we're gonna try and jump it today. Right now, before we take uh, take the caddy or the sport track back to the scrapyard. So let's line this up and light it on fire. Well, as always, that went super well. The van somehow made it up the hill and then came back down. Um, yeah, so it is leaking a lot under there. So anyways, Justin's just over there. He's digging out the trench, gonna try and get the water out. And then, uh, yeah, so we're gonna load up the, probably the Cadillac or the sport track and take it back to the scrapyard. It's three o'clock, so we gotta get going. And uh, yeah, carry on. Let's get her loaded up and then uh, go pick up another van. Woo! So we were hoping to jump the van, but the tranny went, but it's okay because all of a sudden the Ford Sport Track came back to life. And man, did she jump, holy. She wanted to prove she was still good. She wanted, you know, sometimes you gotta give it a couple week rest, let it think about what it's done. And it's, oh, that was amazing. I put it in four by, the first time I put it in neutral, it rolled all the way down the hill, went over the jump, and I was like, frick. It's so hard to get that thing in gear, it's screwed. So anyways, I took it back to the top, four by four, drive, gone. So anyways, we're running late. We gotta get back to the scrapyard, take this thing in, pick up one more minivan. And then, uh, yeah, I guess we'll lock this video up for the day. But uh, yeah, things are going well. Things were taking a bit of a dive for the day. and We're a little worried because we're trying to get three videos done today because I'm gonna be gone for a bit. I'm going off grid, no Wi-Fi, no service or anything. So I just wanted to get ahead of myself. So you guys always have videos and you always are entertained. So anyways, we'll get this thing strapped down and we'll head to the yard. Later minivan, thanks for nothing. Come on next. Let's see if we 
got any other vehicles for us. Look at the freaking stack they got going there. There's the Subaru, the Malibu, a couple vans. I've destroyed a lot of those cars. <laughs> All right, so we had a minivan, but he lost the key. Oh, there's the old weapon. He's got this Buick. Can I even get out of here? It's a nice car. <laughs> uh, Maybe wedged back in here. Some tires in the way. Maybe I can move these tires and see if I can get around here. See how she starts. Fire the girl up. <laughs> oh yeah, it smells like grandma's car. Bit of gas. That's all we need. Load her up. Jesus. I thought that was a rock. I thought that was a rock. No, no, not that stupid. Are we good? Yeah, you're good enough. Good enough? Oh, yeah. Sure. Good enough. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Let's get her home. And back to the compound with the Buick. We've been getting a lot of Buicks, right? Yeah. Something about these LeSabers. Apparently no one likes them or old people own them and the dealership just tells them they need to scrap it and buy a new one. Because we've been getting a lot. Apparently these things light on fire too. So I had that one light on fire in the winter and Trudgeon told me that these things are famous for lighting on fire. So I'm going to take it, take it off the chair. Yeah, I can't talk. Bacon. You have a bacon air freshener? And take her off the trailer. We're gonna do a quick, uh, quick spin with her, and then I'm gonna, uh, gonna do a massive burnout. Can you let me do this? Yeah, just, just checking her out. Just checking you... out the. Uh... Oh, dibs. dibs. What'd you find? Dibs. Uh oh. Uh, never mind. You can have it. What is it? Adjustable wrench. No adjustment. Oh yeah, I saw that in there. Got really excited. Uh, all right. You want to take this? Yeah. Take this, Chief. There you go. Ah, I almost lost her. Easy on the fenders. Get up. Get the I like to warm these girls up. You gotta do this next part a little fast. There we go. Driving like a grandpa. I'm trying to figure out where the traction control is. You're driving like a grandpa. I don't know where the traction control button is. Did you just squeal your tires on dirt? I don't freaking know. Did you just squeal your tires on dirt? I did. It's like the movies. What the heck happened here? You're missing half the freestyle ramp there, Freeman. There's dirt burnout. I've seen better donuts and burnouts on the internet. That was pretty sad. Huh, it's a Brad then. Sign up for Brad? Huh? That was pretty sad. Yeah, I know, I, I couldn't see where I was. Boards are moved, let's try this again.
egg roasted. the tires again. I heard a squeal. I know. I heard the squeal. <laughs> we did it. That's it. <laughs> I somehow squealed it on dirt. That was terrible. Other than your backwards, it's, whatever it's, it was. I don't know. It says traction control active, but I don't see a button. So I'm over it. I don't care anymore. Did you look in the glove box? I checked in there twice, actually. Check again. Um, yeah, so that was a day. You know, it started going bad, but then we... It went north. Started going south, went north. Anyways, we're gonna wrap this up for now. Thank you guys as always. If you have any suggestions for vehicles to jump, let us know. Be excited for tomorrow. You're gonna see the sport track fly through the air and it flew. And then uh, we're gonna start doing, we're gonna have Maverick week. So we're gonna do a whole week of side-by-side -side videos. So be excited. I'm excited, hope you're excited. Check out the links below, leave a nice comment. We'll see you later.